Hello, I'm Choi Urim. Hi, I'm Byung Won Jung. I will start the presentation with a poem which is embedded deeply in my heart. I will be the salt of the world. I reject the untruth, worship the truth, and will proceed to the ideal. Born as a son of the Republic of Korea, I'll be reborn as a young man in the world. I won't close my eyes to the problems around me and will listen to what is happening on the other side of the world. This is part of the charter of Jungsan-in. When I first came to Jungsan High School, I was very impressed with the charter on the wall of the school's main entrance, and I made a decision. I'm not going to spend my high school life with only studies, but fill it with meaningful things that can help my school, my country, and the world. Are we really living as the Jungsan charter taught us? Is it curious? From now, we will show you the original look of Jungsan students. In the poetry recitation contest, student A made a difficult decision to wear a hanbok to express his passion. But despite all his effort, he fell out of the competition. In this case, should he be worried, expecting his friends to laugh at him? No. His passion inspired many of his friends, which made them elect him as class president for the second semester. And this experience in Jungsan has taught him a lesson that he does not need to be afraid to fail. Senior student B applied for mentorship because he wanted to raise the grades of his close friends. Since B was a self-directed student, he was able to teach better than anyone else about how to study. Also, with his prudent attitude, he was able to teach with affection. Through this meaningful process, he learned to share his strengths with his fellow friends. I wanted to participate in the Chinese and English competition with student C, who has outgoing personality. However, these contests seemed unnecessary to student C, who wants to major medicine or science in college. So I hesitated when I asked him to join me. But C's answer was very cool. I don't really care about university entrance examination. If it is something that can make me grow, then I'll do it. Let's do it together. C's attitude like this allows him to go through a lot of experience, and this will be very beneficial to C's life. One of the interesting rumors related to student D's beneficence, there are rumors that he found a friend who ran away from middle school and made him return to school. D tries his best these days as the class president, uh, trying to help the friend, wanting to help the teacher about him because he wanted to, he saw the teacher trying to help the friend with a personal problem. He still doesn't know how, but we have no doubt that this experience will make him a warmer and more responsible person. In this way, we all grew up in Jungsan, but we were not satisfied with this. We wondered if there was any way for us to become like the salt of the world, so we tried to find it. There is a saying in the Bible, knock, and the door will be opened to you. We finally found something meaningful. We became interested in the situation in Myanmar, and with the help of a senior, we became, we, we became to know the uh, Myanmar Youth Association and had the opportunity to actually help them. Quickly proposing to the student council, and after three discussion and meetings, we finally developed a plan. The plan was something like this. First, free discussion and information gathering on Myanmar. Second, invitation of Myanmar speakers. Third, campaign. Fourth, batch purchase through fundraising. Fifth, batch placement movement. And last, sixth, dissemination of this movement to neighboring schools. Of these, we have done up to the second step, and we will complete all the remaining steps in the second semester. Through these activities, our view of the world has expanded even further, and we became to know that we can actually help change the world. Most importantly, we realized that knowledge without action is useless. There's one more thing we're planning which seems to be taking a while. This to build a school in Africa with my middle and high school friends. I have always admired Clayton Kershaw couple who built a school in Africa. The couple were high school classmates. They recall their high school memories like this. At Highland Park High School, we learn from each other's foolish mistakes and gathered wisdom together. My grandmother and her high school graduates built the girls' high school in Burundi, Africa. The name of the school is Chae Jongsuk School, which is named after their high school principal. Our plan to establish a school in Africa will be a milestone in our lives, and the moment we achieve this, we will truly become the salt of the world. When I think of the day another school will be built on the other side of the world and make Korea shine, my heart beats fast. It may be the day when we fulfill our Jungsan Charter, which is listening to what's happening on the other side of the world. Jungsan High School that gave us big dreams, thank you, and I love you. Way to go, Jungsan! Thank you for listening.